The Yard Center Team Report is brought to you by the Debbie Ree Team, Just Comfort Shoes, and is produced exclusively by Twin Fin Media and Marketing. We're always looking for new art to feature on the Arts and Tim Report, and today we're in luck because we got to go behind the scenes of Lucky Glass Studio and see how these beautiful works of art come together. For more than a decade now, Lucky has been crafting beautiful, functional, and unique art glass. He has a huge local following, and businesses, pardon the pun, glowing. So learning, it was, you know, I had a vision in my head what I wanted to make. So a lot of self-teaching, trial and error. So now my visions are becoming a little easier to, you know, replicate in the glass. Really just having fun with my free time. I'm looking to always learn new things each day. It's definitely seven days a week, you know, 12 to 16 hours a day. Uh, and you have to wear a lot of hats, you know, you have to not only be able to make this glass, there's a lot of things that you have to do at once, and uh, it's, it's definitely a rewarding uh, job, I can say that much. This is really particularly interesting. Tell me a little bit about this. That's one of the, um, I guess you would say, custom pieces I'd, I do for somebody. I guess a loved one had passed away, and they had some of the, you know, the cremains of that person and wanted me to incorporate it into some jewelry for them. I kind of felt that yeah, really touched at the time because I, I didn't know how to approach it. But after, you know, completing it and seeing the face, you know, their expression when I did it, it you know, it's one of those priceless feelings that I just can't take back. Wow, that was a fascinating look at a beautiful and colorful art of glass making. Hope you guys enjoyed it as much as we did. For the Arts and Tamer Report, I'm here with Michael Sprouse. I'll see you at the show. <laughs>